University, and we're talking to the president of Tennessee State University, Dr. James Hefner. Of course, Dr. Hefner, before we had our final uh, commercial break, we were talking about uh, your recent trip to uh, Nigeria, you and the wife and <clears throat> several other uh, individuals and several other dignitaries. Uh, but now let's uh, sort of come back home again and uh, to have you to uh, sort of uh, wrap this show up for today by talking about your academic program, some of the things that you'd like to uh, address dealing with your academic program, and more specifically to talk about the athletic program and uh, the upcoming football season and uh, some of the other things associated with the fact that Tennessee State University is moving into the new uh, Titan yes. uh, Stadium. Let's talk about it from that perspective. Well, in terms of academic programs, new academic programs, um, obviously the Adamu uh, mm -hmm. professorship is, is new. Mm -hmm. Um, given to us by the ambassador. Mm -hmm. We also have some uh, doctoral programs that I'm very proud of, PhD programs. Mm -hmm. We have a PhD program in psychology, mm -hmm. a PhD program in biology, and that is a real mm -hmm. good program mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. And then we have a PhD program in psychology. Mm -hmm. I think I said public administration, mm -hmm. psychology, and biology. Mm -hmm. Then we have a number of EDD programs. Mm -hmm. But um, I would think that uh, by the time this show airs, uh, we will have a Ph.D. program in computer engineering, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and that will be an outstanding one mm -hmm. uh, for the university. Mm -hmm. We are a doctoral one institution. That says mm -hmm. that we are at the top. Good. Uh, we are with uh, the University of Memphis and mm -hmm. University of Tennessee mm -hmm. in terms of doctoral programs, so I'm very mm -hmm. proud of that. Good. We um, also have, uh, I think, done a, a very, very good job. Uh, in the area of some master's programs, mm -hmm. uh, we have a commercial a music program mm -hmm. and we are now interacting and intersecting with the uh, with the country music good. industry mm -hmm. here mm -hmm. very good and we hired a young man a Yale degree mm -hmm. uh, and he has done a fantastic job mm -hmm. of working with us with respect to the country music industry mm -hmm. our foundation dinner that we had uh, recently uh, last year we had a, a, a country the year before we had a country music singer mm -hmm. and he was just extraordinary mm -hmm. and hopefully we'll bring on golf Brooks to okay uh, very good to, uh, mm -hmm. uh, do some things at the mm -hmm. university but mm -hmm. uh, the country music uh, 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 major is one that that I'm very very proud of mm -hmm. in addition to those doctoral programs I just mentioned mm -hmm. very good now uh, let's talk about uh, the uh, athletic program and the very fact that uh, for so many years, uh, there was a struggle in terms of uh, whether or not Tennessee State University would uh, have uh, an improved uh, facility on campus and et cetera and et cetera. You know that story. Let's talk yes. about that. Where do we stand and what, what is the situation in reference to that now? Uh, my smile is a function <laughs> of the fact that uh, we have a new stadium. Uh -huh. uh, we call our downtown stadium and it's occupied by the Titans. Mm -hmm. uh, known as the Houston Oilers at one time, mm -hmm. now the Tennessee Titans, mm -hmm. and of course Tennessee State University. Mm -hmm. um, we have incredible facilities there. Um, we have um, our own locker room, mm -hmm. uh, concession dollars and parking dollars. Every game that we play, mm -hmm. we get those funds. Uh, we have a, a, a luxury suite uh, for mm -hmm. the president's guests, mm -hmm. which I think is very, very, very good. Mm -hmm. but it's a 70,000 seated stadium mm -hmm. and uh, uh, we'll, we'll play our first game and more than likely by the time this show airs mm -hmm. uh, we will have played our first game with Alabama State mm -hmm. and it's a new classic it is it'll be called the John Merck Labor Day Classic, classic. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and uh, hopefully um, we, I can I can say it in a, in a la later show mm -hmm. that uh, we were victorious mm -hmm. over uh, Alabama Bama, State. Uh -huh. Now mm -hmm. we have some other games too. Mm -hmm. We'll be playing in the Southern Heritage Classic, playing mm -hmm. Jackson State mm -hmm. in uh, in Memphis and in Atlanta, Florida and M mm -hmm. at the Atlanta Classic. So, but the most important thing is that we are the second college in the United States mm -hmm. to occupy an NFL stadium. Mm -hmm. You have Tulane and now Tennessee State. Mm -hmm. And and that says a lot about uh, how we recruit uh, mm -hmm. athletes. And I believe that ticket sales will be enormous. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have already uh, in place a mechanism for selling tickets. Mm -hmm. We expect over 50,000 mm -hmm. uh, people to attend 
that first game. Mm -hmm. Then we have our homecoming there. So we play five games mm -hmm. in the stadium mm -hmm. uh, this year, and I'm very pleased about mm -hmm. that. Well, what about uh, season tickets? Uh, what if a person would, de would uh, desire to have a, a season ticket for all of those games? Well, I mean, how well let me tell you, they, 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 it's, it's an economy kind of situation. Mm -hmm. Five games for $50. Five games for fifty dollars, and in, that in is the incredible. That's right, in the it stadium. It is. It's incredible, and it that's is. a season ticket. Five mm. games, and you pay fifty dollars, and I expect it excess of fifty thousand. Mm -hmm. Now, last year, in um, in Memphis, we had fifty six thousand. The year before, we had sixty one thousand. Mm -hmm. I want to break the uh, sixty one thousand record. I mm -hmm. want at least sixty eight thousand mm -hmm. in that stadium, mm -hmm. Labor Day. Uh, mm -hmm. that Labor Day uh, mm -hmm. weekend uh, here in Nashville. Mm -hmm. And of course I think it is possible to do Dr. Heppner because I think that the uh, team has shown through all of the classics and whatnot that they can draw a large number of people and of course let me thank you Dr. Heppner as we uh, end uh, this show for today over the last 25 seconds that we have for coming by and giving us that excellent information about Tennessee State University and I think uh, something that you've promised us all along that one day that there will be a metamorphosis of Tennessee State <laughs> University. I think we can really declare today that that is true. And for those who have not had an opportunity to see Tennessee State University over the last year and a half or so, would really be surprised. And so let us thank you for coming by. Thank you very much. And let us encourage our audience to tune in again next week for another informative edition of Comments. Thank you and good morning.